Hey, it's Mr. Peace. I'm here at Mission Meadows Elementary School, home of the Mustangs in Oceanside, California, and part of the Vista Unified School District. Uh, I got to share my heart again with the after school program, the AMPM program. And the main focus on today's topic was about positivity, with the sub theme being be your best self, which you see on the screen. And look, uh, days like today uh, here in California, beautiful, sunny, which is usually the norm, uh, but there's obviously days that aren't like that. But days like today, of course, it's easy to be positive. You know, things are going great. Uh, they got movie night tonight, Super Mario Brothers, I believe. <laughs> uh, you know, so it's a fun day, things are going awesome. Of course, easy to be positive. But on the days where it's raining out, kind of yucky, maybe things aren't going our way or things aren't going the best inside here in our hearts, of course, it's not as easy to maintain that positive mentality. But that's what I was really trying to preach today is to say, hey, you know, even on the times where we can feel down and get down on ourselves or on others, uh, we need to still be able to think more positively, right? Be able to keep our head up. That's why I wear this shirt for this assembly. Words are upside down on purpose because if you look down or feel sad, it's a reminder to always keep our head up, right? And just always keep pushing, persevering, knowing that the opposite of success is not quitting. Sorry, the opposite of success is not failure. It's quitting or it's giving up, right? We can fail over and over and over again and then finally succeed, but if we don't even try, then we have no chance, right? And so we also know part of doing our best is to encourage others, to raise them up, that we rise by lifting them as well. And, you know, also knowing that uh, it's not that we have to always get first place or get the trophy or the medal or 100% on everything, you know, uh, true excellence, it's not about being the best, it's about doing your best, right? It's just giving the effort. And if you give the effort, usually nine times out of 10, maybe 10 times out of 10, you're, gonna, you're probably gonna get the outcome that you want. If we can plant those positive thoughts in here and in here, because the person we're gonna speak most to in our life is ourselves, uh, but if we wanna tell it something more positive in our brain and in our hearts, you know, it's gonna believe whatever you tell it. And so if we can plant those positive seeds more or less, those positive thoughts, you know, we start to get more positive results throughout our lives. And so through a series of inspirational videos, uh, the picture slides, some really heartfelt stories, the students really got that. And a lot of them came up to me after even some of the staff and said that this program really meant a lot to them because, you know, we're so quick to be negative and get down on ourselves and stay down. But if we can be able to rise back up and know that certain things that are tough and difficult, subject in school, a friendship, a team activity that we're doing, you know, of course they can be very hard, but those are opportunities to make us stronger too, if we let them, right? So again, thank you so much for touching my heart. You're all beautiful. I'll see you again in 2024. Have a great rest of 2023 and a start to the new year as well. And as always, make sure to hit the subscribe button. You'll see pop up on the screen. You can also check out this playlist below for some additional motivation and feel free to visit my website by clicking on the peace sign symbol on your phone tablet. Wherever you're watching this video to track my journey across this country as I continue to heal America's heart one school at a time. Peace.